alaikum everyone. My name is Iman. Uh, my name is Amal. And you're watching a weird and wonderful podcast. Yes, um, you are. Yes, they are. Um, I just wanted us to just kind of go back so that people know a little bit more about us. Okay. And let's talk about how we first met. Okay. You can go with that because you're We're, the one who met me. I met you. Well, technically you met all of us at the same time. Sure. So if you have not caught on, Amal and I are actually sisters. A lot of people think we look alike, but I don't see it at Really? All. No. I think we look alike. No. Why? What's wrong with us? No, no. I'm just saying I don't think we look alike. That's all. And I think we look similar. Okay. I definitely don't think we look like twins. But I think we look similar. Sure. How, how did you meet me? <laughs> <laughs> well, firstly, you were born on my birthday. Right. So you kind of stole my thunder. It was my sixth birthday. Mm-hmm. And you know, six birthdays are very important. Really? Yeah. Sure. So because it was my birthday, I wanted to dress really nicely. Mm-hmm. So before Mama left for the hospital, she had bought me this like really nice pink velvet dress. I don't even remember it. No. It's like long sleeves mm-hmm. and then it like comes to the knees and it's pink velvet, like soft pink and it had like a little rosebud right here. And then she bought me a matching pink velvet hat. I remember the hat, but I don't remember the shirt. I mean the dress. Oh, okay. okay. Well, you were zero years old, so you probably yeah. didn't remember anything. Um, yeah, so it was my birthday, so mm-hmm. I was dressing up for my birthday. Right. Because in our family, we don't celebrate birthdays. That's true. Yeah, so I said, okay, then at least I look nice on my birthday. Mm-hmm. And then you came. And you weren't happy. Well, it's not so much that I wasn't happy. It was just like, why did it have to be today? Fair enough. You know, because it's not only going to affect me today, it's going to affect me for the rest of my life. <laughs> but we don't celebrate birthdays. So. I know, but there was that one time that Mama bought us a card and she wrote both our names on it. Yeah. Like, I would understand, like, if she bought a cake and wrote both our names on it. Not that she did, because we don't We'd, celebrate We've birthdays. never had a cake. But, but there was one time, I remember, she got us a card and she wrote both our names on it. Okay. Yeah, I don't remember that. I don't remember anything, apparently. So, so yeah. w- I mean, okay, when what was your first, like, memory of me? Of you? Yeah. I know that I did not like you. Only because you were very girly. That's all. Because we're girls. Yeah, I know, but I wasn't girly. So uh, I didn't like you very much. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> I prefer to hang out with our brother. Uh, yeah, that's what I remember of you as a child. <laughs> She's so boring. So we're basically, we are four siblings. I'm the eldest. I'm the third. And Amal's number three. And then um, we have, so it's basically Iman, Abdul Aziz, oh. Amal, and then Abdullah. Um, I always feel like I have been the guinea pig. That is true. You were born in a different hospital. I was born in a different hospital. I have a different... (laughs) My name starts with a different letter. Yes, that's true. You all went to the same college. We all went to the same... I went to a different... It's like mom and papa tried all these things on me. And and obviously it did not work out. So they did something for all the other three. And it worked out. It always worked out for Abla's evidently because (laughs) me and Dula always... (laughs) Um, went his path. So I always feel like the failure child sometimes. Not failure, it's guinea pig, like you said. Yeah, well, you know, I took one for the team, so. Like, I had my BCG and none of you guys had to do it. Really? We don't have BCGs? Well, but yours, your... I think you just reacted differently to it. Oh, is it? No, I think we all did it. Oh, okay. Okay, but if there was one positive memory that you had of me. You like to dress up a lot. So uh, we would play dress up and I didn't mind that. <gasps> Do you remember when, because um, obviously we can't have dogs, but then we watch a lot of movies <laughs> with dogs in them. <laughs> so whenever we'd play, yeah, we, I, I would make you guys be my dog. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I remember that. Yeah, and my dog name was always Arissa. Do you remember that? No, I thought I called you Honey. Oh, that because you're always um, really? golden I retrievers. Seriously? <laughs> yeah. Well, well, I picture it in my head that you guys oh, are always golden okay. retrievers. Yeah. No, I I always remember that my name was like Arissa the dog or something like that, and we would like walk around the house. I and thought uh, I thought Arissa was your mermaid name. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I cannot remember. <laughs> but yeah, no, I remember on all fours you'd walk around the house and would just follow you. I, I liked I liked the, the dog game. Yeah, the and, dog game was fun. And I liked the the airplane game. Which one was that? Like I would we would go into the living room uh, the dining room mm-hmm. and Susan all the chairs like two 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 like we were on an airplane. Okay, I semi remember this. And then I'll let you and I'll just would have your little suitcases and I'll be the stewardess and then I'll welcome you. And then I'd also be the pilot. And then after I put you your seatbelts on, I'd go behind you mm-hmm. and during takeoff, like I'll pull the chair back. <laughs> 
<laughs> you don't remember I have, this? I have a vague memory. It's very vague. Um, it's a nice memory, evidently, for you. Yeah, those are like the best times. Yeah. No, I remember having a good time when... Uh, I wasn't around? No, <laughs> when Ablezis was involved. So, you know, he could make sure it w- didn't get too girly. I don't know. But he's so boring now. <laughs> <laughs> No, otherwise you're really fun. She didn't mean that. Yeah, yeah, you're nice. Yeah. But yeah, I think overall we had a good childhood. And yeah, that's how we met. <laughs> that's how we met. It's so nice knowing you. Yeah, it's, it's been good. It's, it's been, been like a 22 years. 22 years. Yeah. 22 years. <laughs> so, yeah. How are we now? Uh, well, to be fair, I think when we were kids, like I said, I didn't like you very much because mm-hmm. of the whole girly thing. Not to say I didn't like you. I preferred to hang out with Dula and Ablazis because right. they were more boyish. And I wanted to be a boy as a child. Um, and that was why. It, don't take it personally. Like, it's not like How you. do I not take it personally? Just, just girls in general, you know. Anyway. Um, yeah, but I think I, I got over that, I think. And we're we're pretty good friends now. Yeah, I yeah, I think we're good friends. You're the needier one in the relationship. And Why would you say that? Because it's true. Okay, fine. Yeah. Um, but I definitely think that sharing a room really yes, helped. Yes, we did. We shared a yeah. room. Yeah. Even though you were like far away on the other side, and I was on this side. But you know, it was, it was fun. Good. It was good. I I witnessed your teenage angst. Oh yeah, sorry about that. You know. In your, um, you helped me cover up all the boys I liked. All, all the boys, all the all the late night hey, conversations. I was <laughs> gonna hear this, <laughs> mom. I did not have any late night conversations. I was lying. Sure. sure. <laughs> yeah. Um, but I think I think the th- the defining like era or period mm-hmm. was when you moved to Canada. Yeah, and we lived. And we lived together as adults. Years. Yeah, as adults. Like I no think. more adult supervision, no more mom and papa. Yeah. But I d- okay. You remember how we did a pack? at one point because I was like in my I was tr- trying to get healthy and mm-hmm. I was like cooking every day yeah. and then we made a pact that I would do all the cooking and you would do all the grocery and the laundry yeah. and the laundry and I just recently found out that you don't actually like my cooking I'm so sorry <laughs> I, I did eat everything though I did eat everything. Amal you could eat grass if someone told you that somebody made it and you would feel bad potentially yes but why is it that you don't like my cooking because I worked, for, I'm a, I slaved for hours and I mean, hours, and I made you all individual Tupperwares, I know, and I wrote there Amal prepped. breakfast, and I wrote a heart, Did Amal you lunch, ever write heart. Yeah, sometimes oh, I'd even do flowers. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, I'm so sorry. I I don't remember any. Of that, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Sometimes even a snack. No, I don't know. It was just like, I I, I don't know what you were going for. You know what was the <laughs> theme there? <laughs> but like, it was just it was okay. It was a, w- was it gourmet? Gourmet <laughs> is gourmet. I know, I know. Um, <laughs> yeah. Anyway, was it gourmet? Uh, no, but it was edible. Yeah. And I l- eat to live. No, I don't live to eat, so it, I didn't mind. You eat to live. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, so so like, it's not you really enjoy food. Yeah, I wouldn't call myself a foodie. Like if you, you know, boil me an egg and say that's breakfast i'll be all right and yeah I'll, and i'll eat it you know no but i definitely do consider you like one of my best friends thanks because i don't have many so the pool is very small <laughs> so don't flatter it, yourself it's slim pickings it's slim pickings yeah but yeah no i think i think we're just at a good point right now where i think we've also grown up and like yeah seen other people's relationships with like siblings and i've really come to accept that you know siblings aren't just like friends like yeah your siblings have to become friends right. at some point but they are the only ones that are really going to be there for you in the end. Because we have to, kind of. Yeah. It it's kind of choice. like a... It, it's, it's like a pact that happens as soon as you come out of the same person. <laughs> That's it, It's just a given, you know? Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. So uh, all in all, Iman thinks she's the funny one. But <laughs> apparently I am. Uh, yeah. But... You know, I just think that i really appreciate you as a sister and i feel like we discover a lot of fun things together like we've been on a lot of fun trips together Mm -hmm. we've experienced lots of interesting moments together yeah and i think when i was asked to do this podcast you were like the first person right that i really want then you had to (coughs) drag me here i had to convince you yeah because you're a little bit shyer not I, i wouldn't say shy it's more like 
I'm uncomfortable with people knowing too much about me. Right. I don't know if that's considered shy. Because yeah. I feel like I'm not really a shy person. Right. I'm just reserved. Right. Yeah. But now people know that you've pretended to be a dog called a <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'll let that one slip. Uh, um, yeah. So yeah, but so on our podcast, we mm-hmm. talk about a lot of really interesting things. Maybe. You don't think they're interesting? <laughs> no, to some people. To some people. So yeah, no, they are interesting to us. Uh, we're uh, we've talk- We're going to talk about books and um, period. Taboo. Tab- taboo topics. Ta- topics are of taboo. Um, and I just think overall, we just want to talk about things that people would relate to. And people yeah, would ju- just everyday conversations. You're just going to be listening to me and you want to talk it out. Yeah, because you want to yeah. be your friend. You want to be their friend. I want to be... You, yeah. oh, you don't want to be their friend? <laughs> Some people. I'm okay. I'm okay. You're set on the front side. <laughs> okay, guys, if you want to listen to more conversations like this, um, please subscribe to Dops TV on YouTube and on Spotify. And inshallah, we'll have more podcasts like this for you to listen to. Stay tuned, guys. Stay tuned. Subscribe below. <laughs>